Music. I'll give you whatever you want. Money, women, men. The Lion, 9.7 FM. Fiend, can you hear me? Yeah, what's up, what's up? What's up, what's up, what's up, man? We got the I Want the World instrumental in the background, man. It's a, a tough track. I appreciate it, homie. What's I up? want the world. <laughs> I feel you, I feel you. Every, yeah, you want all the world and everything in it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so it's good, man. So I'm seeing a lot of things here about you. Uh, I heard this, the song. I see the new mixtape that's out, Leap of Faith. What's going on with, with that? Leap of Faith. Leap of Faith has is is been a long time coming. Uh, you know what I'm saying? If I could give him a little background, man. My name is Fiend. I came from uh, York, Pennsylvania. Ain't too far from Penn State. Yeah, I heard you was born in uh, the West Coast. Is that true? Yeah, I was, I was born in Cali, but I really honestly only spent about a year, year and a half out there, and then I moved. Oh, uh, okay. They'll say the PA. I've been there ever since. Central PA. Okay, that's what's up. That's what's up. So uh, what, what, what's some of your early influences that, that got you into the game? Um... Back in the days, man, I listened to everything, but cannabis, Nas, Hove, of course, uh, Pac, you know what I'm saying, Biggie, all the greats, man. You know, I was, I was big on Wu-Tang back in the days. That's what's up, not, e- <laughs> not even just hip-hop, man. Just, you know, I, it's Dude. funny, but I, I'm in the groups, like, way back. I remember being a kid buying the Soul Asylum tape and... Whoa, okay. Power, power, back all kinds of stuff, man. Oh, that's what's up, that's what's up. So you got a wide range of... Uh, uh, influences that that gives you this unique style. I mean, I'm saying I'm saying a lot of big things about you, man. I saw that the Street Report magazine. Uh, they're saying that you sound like a Kanye and a Slick Rick. I, I say more like a Kanye kid, Cuddy. I mean, what what what, what really got you into these uh, this type of East Coast type of uh, rapping right now? Coming from York, PA. I mean, I mean, is there a lot of urban community out there in York? Yeah, I mean it's it's a small it's a small city, but I grew up in the city. You know what I mean? I grew up a lot of the same problems as any other city, any big city. You know, you got. I mean, there's not a lot of uh, opportunities as far as big companies and things like of that nature. So you got a lot of people struggling. You know what I mean? So when I rap about the struggle, it's it's what I see. It's what I'm going through. Or my or my you know my best friend is going through this. Or, you know his. Pops is going, you know, down the wrong road, and he got to suffer because of it. And things, yeah, everything is real. Like that's what's up, man. Yeah, yeah. Everybody relates to the struggle, man. I mean, everybody goes through their own type of struggle. So I, I'm, it's glad. I'm glad to see you pushing through there. So I see. I see that you also worked with Lloyd and Cassidy. How, how, how was that? Yeah, I mean, there's just some people I um, opened up for in their shows with. You know, um, when they came through through my city, came through York. Luckily, the promoters out there, they seen what I was about. They seen, you know, the type of uh, work work ethic I was putting in. They let me rock with them, so. Yeah, man. Just, yeah, your work ethic is kind of crazy. I'm like, I'm seeing like over 400 mixtapes, man, <laughs> over the last three years. And that's more than Lil Wayne right now, man. <laughs> you putting in that work. Yeah, not all, not all personal theme mixtapes, but yeah, just like different DJs. That's one thing I could say. A, a lot of DJs have... Uh, opened up doors for me, you know what I mean? So, so, DJs have been there from the start with hip-hop, man. I think a lot of artists nowadays with the internet are forgetting that. But uh, DJs, you know what I mean? I, I really try to stay connected with the DJs. Shout out to the DJs at Penn State, man. Uh, DJ Pete Butter, you know I'm saying, uh, New York Giant, my man Karis out there, shutting it down all the time. So, definitely shout out to the DJs. Yeah, that's what's up. That's what's up, man. I see, and I see that you are you you are award recipient, man. I see that you won five trophies, trophies, best male art, artist and best mixtape for the Central PA Hip Hop Awards. Uh, how was that for you? That was amazing, man. That that was amazing. <laughs> to be honest, I mean, I really started taking my craft serious probably about 2004. Since then, I've put out Leap of Faith is my seventh mixtape, solo wow. mixtape, so. You know, every year, pretty much, I'm, I was dropping something. That's and, what's up. I mean, I, w- I would be that kid really standing outside of the gas station, pushing my CD to complete strangers. You know what I mean? So all that time where people looking at me like I'm crazy, like, what? This kid really out here doing this? And then for it to come to fruition, winning awards and people really getting behind me, my movement and everything, and, and getting noticed on that type of level, you know, it's just amazing. It's a blessing. 
That's what's up, man. So, uh, so what's your social network, man? Your Facebook, your Twitter. How can the people get at you and, and get more of your music? Um, I got a. I spell my name Fiend. It's uh, P H E N E. So you can go to Fiend.net, and um, like you said, my new mixtape Leap of Faith is available on there for free. Um, I also run and operate a website called HighOffLife.com. So you can check me out on there. Um, so I'm on Facebook. I'm on MySpace. I'm on Twitter. Reverb Nation. Uh, I know Twitter popular right now. You uh, hit me up at Fiend at P H E N E. You know, hit me up directly. I'm down to earth. I talk. To Talk to whoever, man. You know what I'm saying? Just let me know what you're thinking. All right, that's what's up. All right, and, and I want you to do, do me a favor just before you leave now. I want you to introduce the you know, writing on the wall song of the Leap of, Leap of Faith mixtape. You, you think you could do that for me real quick? Yeah, definitely. And, and uh, you know, I want to thank you, my man, for, for allowing me to you know jump on the show. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Penn State is crucial to me, man. I, I was actually just in the restaurant listen, uh, watching the Penn State game. <laughs> oh, for real? Uh, I it's, definitely try, try to rep Penn State where I go, but um, that's what's you know, look out for my new CD as well called God on the Greyhound. That's the new solo album that's coming out um, oh, that's later this year, so definitely look for that. Uh, this song right here is called Writing on the Wall. It's really an ode to my, to my hometown, to York, PA. You know, we shot a video for it. You can ch check that out on YouTube. But yeah, we're going to get into it, man. Writing on the Wall. All right, thanks a lot. Just hold on, man. okay, Fee? WKPS, stay calm. Right. I'll give you whatever you want. Money, women, men. Lion, 90.7 FM.